I don't have my steel tongue drum. So ding dong, ding dong. Good morning from Fort Clark Springs, Texas on a cool morning. I think the temperature is about 48 degrees. Feels cool. And uh, yeah, it's about 60 in here, which is fine with me. And then what else? Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, day before tomorrow. It's right now. And right now, it just went right on by. So if there's anything you want to do, dun 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 you better get started. What else? What else? What else? Never worry about what you cannot change. And I can change uh, this. I can be in, in Lano, Texas uh, this afternoon. Will I? I hope. We're, we're on the road again today, guys. <sighs> I just love my life. Yeah, no, I'm fine, guys. I'm fine. So what else we got going on here? Uh, let me show you something. Uh, I don't know who sent these things, but I, I thought I, I didn't do a, a mail call. I may do one when I get back. But this came from HWM Liberty, I think. Yeah, uh, Stephanie, it's a Christmas card. It says, we wish you a Merry Christmas. Uh, and uh, she uh, also sent a, uh, well, the card, the, the envelope was cute, but it's all covered with stuff, you know. And it's uh, Rusty SPO Box 146, Bracketville, Texas, 78832. But it's a pretty card. I mean, a pretty card and envelope and it's and in it was a uh it says cozy vibes only and it's a pot holder thing and yeah thank you very much hwm liberty stephanie and also i got in the mail yesterday i just got this uh it's a uh it's a, like a class b on a, a mercedes chassis somebody sent me this i, I think i got it right here let's hear you it says uh Everyday Explorer, Chuck. Chuck, Chuck, don't do it, don't do it. Anyway, yeah, it's a, uh, the, the little door is open, everything. See, it open, the door open. It's, it's just a little uh, car, you know what I mean? And it's, it's actually got stuff in it, <laughs> you know, in the back. But anyway, it's a cute little thing. Thank you much. But anyway, I'll put that over here in the card and stuff. But anyway, I just wanted to let you know I got it. Because some of you mail stuff and then you think, well, did he get it or what, you know? Well, I got it, I got it. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. And then what else? Since we're on the road today, we, we, we won't abbreviate it much. We'll cut it a little short this morning. Let's see what we got here. Z. Watanejo says, like the RV with Saturn and R2-D2 on it. Oh, yeah, that was, uh, <laughs> he's here every year. Uh, Mr. CJ Cap 64 thumbs up to you twice and three, oh, wait a minute. Same person says, what? I could hear what the hell, <laughs> I couldn't hear what the hell, H-A-I-L, you were saying uh, back on the meds. It was a little loud. The hailstorm was a little bit loud. Scotty Thompson, cool video talk, nice shirt, and cool comment call. Thank you, Scotty Thompson, the masked bowler from Wisconsin. The reason the time on those two clocks is different, I've said before, is this is the real time, and that's my time. So when it, I, I'm an hour off. Anyway, uh, uh, Everyday Explorers says, I just bought the 2024 Scout, did a couple of test campouts at the house. Can't wait to take it to the St. Lawrence Seaway this spring. Good for you. Same person says, your walking videos are the best. Glad no damage. Have a safe trip. Can't wait to see Lano, Texas. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that myself. I want, I'm going to go by and look at that little cabin again and my place over there on East Tarrant Street. And... Uh, yeah, I was really this close to living in Lana. We could be doing this from Lana right now real easily, uh, but, uh, you know, things didn't work out. Uh, Victoria lost pets, some good snow cone mix. Yeah, for the, the, the other hailstones. Texas says, I think the breakfast bell for everyone in the RV part was rusty, given the weather report. <laughs> yeah, could be, could be, could be. No, it, uh yeah, they have a little triangle, you know, the little metal triangle, and they got that little metal bar, and bing, 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 you know what I mean. You go ding, 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 ding. It, well, you know how to go. I'll, never mind. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, Linda Howard, safe, safe, Rusty. Stay safe, Rusty. I will. I'll try to. I'm in no hurry, and uh, I've got everything loaded in the deal. I got my uh, uh, hitch storage thing uh, uh, put together and on the deal. I'll show you that video today. Uh, one thing I'll note, though, in that video, uh, the link takes you to Amazon, but it, the, it says uh, in the uh, description of the product at Amazon that it'll carry 500 pounds. It won't. It'll carry 100 pounds. 
Okay, it's 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 fifty dollars. It's cheap, you know what I mean. But no, for for just a few items, it's it's great, and that's all I'm using it for. Just a few simple little things to get them out of the RV. But yeah, you'll see that today. And then uh, James Jackson Coffee Thirty. Yeah, that could be what that is. Beer Thirty Coffee Thirty for you. Stephen Greco says Rusty Seven Eight Six Zero Nine is my favorite YouTube channel ever. Well, Stephen, I, I'm glad, and and me and you both enjoy it, don't we? <laughs> AP Business Mastery, for your information, in the 2018 Thor Chassis or Thor Chateau 22B, the freshwater tank is behind the access panel under the pantry closet. Uh, the freshwater tank. Well, that's good to know. I mean, in my Thor Four Winds, it was under the seat on the other side of the dining table, and in this thing, it's under the bed at the back. You know, Sashi Smith, hi, sure does look nice and fresh. Thanks for the share. You know, it's a funny thing. After a storm like that, everything does look good. You know, I mean, I mean, well, I say it looks good, but I mean, you know, like it cleared a lot of dead leaves off the trees, uh, washed out, cleaned out some of the creeks because we had a heavy rain for a few minutes. And yeah, that's what causes the, the runoff that causes the creeks to rise. Anyway, what else? Uh, Deborah Kennard, my emoji there. Uh, De same person. Dang, those are weird clouds. Yeah, they are, I guess. I don't know. They're, space, they're spaceships. Uh, MD Grimes. Very pretty. Thank you. Same person. Well, guess the gang's all here. The hail, hail. I got you. That's pretty good. The gang's all here. Belinda Salinas. Yesterday afternoon, they gave an advance on the news of the news, 10 o'clock news. Uh, they mentioned that the hardest hit area in the San Antonio viewing was Natalia. They were pelleted with one inch size hail. Well, that's interesting. No, thank you. Al Fur. Good morning. Good morning to you. He says, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is Vince, Vince Carnival or something like that. I had a coworker who had his Saburu ruined from hell. The year insurance declared it a total, total loss. But it doesn't take much for a vehicle to become a uh, total loss, okay? Because uh, the price of repairs is just ridiculous. You know, anyway, this is on the truck camper installation in Burnett, Texas, a couple of years, three, four, five years ago, whenever that was. Aaron Haley says, where did you get the tailgate seal? Uh, at the, uh, you get it at a parts store. Let me leave her a note on that. She may be waiting for a reply. Uh, get it at... And a u t o p a r t s s t o r e. Got it. Uh, then uh, this is Vic Joax. Vic something Joax, I guess. That was a clever cowboy boot bench you passed on your walk. Yeah, somebody made a bench out of a cowboy boot. It's concrete. Now James Jackson, I'm 71. Life is great. Well, I'm 78 and life's great. Doesn't matter. It, it's not, but you know, living to an old age is interesting. I will say that it is interesting. But if you're not living and you get, grow old, what have you accomplished? You know, I mean, if you're just sitting in a, a rocking chair or, or, you know, not, I mean, it, 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 if you live, you know, like really get out and do things to an old, ripe old age, that's great. Actually, what I really say is, you do you, and you enjoy your life the best way you can. Don't worry about other people. James Jackson, that's a good price. Uh, what's a good price? I don't remember. Uh, Dare Trixa, good evening from the North Sea of Germany. Good evening, Dare Trixa. Hope you're doing well. Dare Trixa says, looks cold. No, it wasn't. It was like 50 degrees. That's not cold. It's cool. Uh, Alice says, greetings from the City of Champions. The wind is vicious here this Sunday, Saturday morning. Poor little birds can't make it to the feeders. Has blown all the water from the bird bath. Sure could use some kind of rain, snow, or even hail. We are ain't picky. Uh, whatever. Uh, good to hear y'all got rain and no hail damage. Yeah, uh, no, we didn't have any, and, and it was a nice rain. Uh, Poodle Professor says, I'm not a wind chime person at all. Well, I'm not either, and most campers are not. But uh, there, there are people in this area, you know, in, in Unit 38, they've got uh, one of those with the bars about this big around that are about three or four feet long. Gong, gong. I'm glad I'm not next to them, but I'm not. 
Thank you. Check her channel out on YouTube, Poodle Professor. Yeah. Alvin Masseau, great video. Yeah, thank you. Uh, they're not great. They're okay. I mean, uh, this is uh, made in the shade. Hail is good for the soil. It releases nitrogen nutrients. Yeah, it does. Usually, if, if it occurs in the spring, which it normally does, actually. It's like April and May when hail occurs in Texas most of the time. Uh, when the seasons change is usually when we get the hail. We usually don't get it in February. No. Mary Cooper, look at those clouds. Awesome looking. See, this person says they're awesome, and the other person said they were weird. So that tells you that we, not see, we don't see the same thing. Sheridan Gay, I'm glad everyone is okay and no damage was sustained through the hailstorm. Did you buy yourself some good breakfast? No, I did not. I, I, I've been there once. You know, it's eight bucks and, and uh, it's okay. I mean, uh, I just don't e eat out that much. Thank you, though. It says, uh, I think it's wonderful the RV park makes breakfast just for for neighbors to get to know each other. Well, yeah, it's, it's some, some people that, that are staying in the RV park that are doing that. Uh, they do it every year. Poodle Professor. It is good to see water standing out there. Yeah, it, it, around here, it, it really is. <clears throat> we'll do three or four more. We'll shut her down here because I'm I'm anxious to get my breakfast eaten because so then I can put the breakfast stuff all that in the in the class B RV and hit the trail. Am I in a hurry? Not really because I don't want to be driving at dark and the sun really doesn't come up until around seven thirty because you know driving at dark on the road I'm going to Rock Springs on is kind of like you know winning the deer lottery. You know. Uh, you have to, but I'm not going to be going at about 40 miles an hour, but it doesn't take much. La Patri or Patri, no dent puller for you this time under your shelter. No, the shelter, this this thing is great because you get everything out of the weather. Yeah. Sashi Smith, good morning, Rusty. We are expecting some major storms this weekend here in California. Happy weekend. Well, happy weekend to you. Yeah, you guys are out in California. See, they went from a drought to a flood. You know, but that's typical. That's so typical. We got two more here. Uh, let's see what we got here. Let's do three here. Anna Marie, I tried to tell you a storm was going. Well, I, I, you, you did tell me. I, I, and I heard you, and it got here. Harley Glide, uh, good morning to all Rangers. Ranger Harley reporting for duty from my uh, hail free Carolina mountains. Uh, Spring was nice yesterday while it lasted all rangers. Stay warm and dry. Get out there and walk and swivel. Thank you, Rusty. Thank you, Harley. Glad. Enjoy your day in the mountains. <clears throat> Patrick Russell, it seems that New Mexico avoided all the California and Texas weather. Probably did, you know. Uh, user says, uh, great deal. That was on the tiny home home depot. And last but not least, this is an old one on a storage building. This is Looks like Sid Sydney. Some. How hard is it to find an economic place to put that home? Hell, how do I know you? I don't even know where you live. You could live in Mars. You know, just check, man. You got to ask. You know, to find out things, you got to ask. Okay. But anyway, having having said that, guys, from Fort Clark, Clark Springs, soon to be Lano, Texas. This is me saying thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything you want, anytime. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Uh, why? Because it doesn't cost you a penny. Yeah, you just click on the link, go to Amazon, and get whatever you're going to get. So if you're going to buy something from Amazon anyway, use the link if you think about it. And then what else? Drink plenty of water. Uh, take deep breaths. Breathe in, breathe out. That lowers stress, which lowers your blood pressure. You know, stretch, walk, all that stuff. And then... Uh, uh, stand guard at the door of your mind. You know, this is your head, your brain, your frontal lobes, your consciousness up here. And uh, yeah, uh, all those little neurons in there are forming neural links, which is every single thought, dream, memory you've ever had. So uh, give your, quote, neurons something positive to work with. Accentuate the positive, eliminate the negative, enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time. At ease, carry on, adios, bye-bye, hasta luego, vaya con Dios, aloha, until... The next video, and on and on we go. I'll do some videos on the drive in Delano. You're going to be covered up with them. You know, softball stuff. You know, easy listening. Adios, amigos. Bye-bye. <laughs> Sunday morning, coming down.